Yo, what's up guys, this is Sick, and today I'm gonna do the 30 minute challenge without listening. So yeah, that's gonna be pretty difficult, probably. <laughs> but yeah, let's go. So, uh, here we are in FO Studio. Uh, the timer is ticking now. So, I'm gonna make it difficult for me. I'm gonna make something more melodic. So I'm gonna start with FL keys, right in E. You can hear the sound, but I can't, I promise. You see, I don't have my headphones on. So I'm gonna, I don't know, I'm just gonna draw some something that could work. Okay, this is not in key. Or maybe go to A. I'm just gonna do a progression that I know can work, <laughs> but <laughs> I don't know if I will make it correct. Okay, let's not complicate it. Okay, so let me make chords. It should be here and this is all right. Yeah, I'm just gonna play them for you. You can judge me. <laughs> So I'm gonna copy it and I'm gonna probably invert them just to make it sound more natural. I'm gonna leave this one here. So uh, we should make them more interesting, I think, because <laughs> this is gonna be probably pretty boring. So I'm gonna add some steps into these chords, maybe like this or I'm gonna do it here in the bass notes uh, so it should be this and maybe something similar here which chord was it E G C I'm gonna do the same G C yeah uh, so I'm gonna play the chords for you Yeah, I can imagine how they sound, but uh, I'm not sure. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna copy the these notes probably. Uh, uh, uh. Wait, how were they? I'm gonna <laughs> invert this back. Okay, I'm gonna just copy these notes because I'm gonna use them as... Or I'm not gonna do this. I'm wasting time. I'm just gonna do probably something like this maybe something dub vision stylish i don't know if this is gonna work yeah let me just start with uh serum and i'm gonna make a new pattern so this is gonna be my baseline i'm just gonna pick a preset maybe that can work uh like something some respace this should work. I'm gonna check if it's like okay. Maybe too low. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just gonna probably go up here. So also up here. I'm not sure it may be too high, maybe too low. <laughs> Who knows? So I think I'm just gonna do something like that vision does. But this is I see it's like an LFO, so I'm gonna make it an envelope. Yeah, this is playing just one note. So I think I will do something like this, like, hmm, but this is not gonna work with the rhythm here. I need to probably change this note. Uh, okay, let me get rid of it. I'm gonna add like maybe, um, some slides, probably. <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna work. 
let me check uh, the slides. I don't know how I'm gonna do the mixing because I'm not good at visual stuff. I do everything by ear. <laughs> so I think this should sound nice. Or maybe I'm just gonna copy it and probably make an ARP. Uh, something similar to... No, I'm gonna go with E and follow like the rhythm of this. Oh, this is gonna be so bad. <laughs> I can already feel it, but at least I know the sounds because I made them. Uh, I don't know, I'm just gonna leave it like this and just copy it like whatever. I'm just gonna play it for you. If it's too bad, then I'm then I'm sorry. <laughs> Wait. Oh, this is the Reese bass. Sorry. <laughs> sorry for your ears. I'm gonna copy. Uh, okay. I need, I need to be faster. Okay. So, let's lay this down. Okay, I'm just gonna copy it over and over and maybe do some change here. Maybe add like, make this more interesting. I think it should sound okay because it's like in E and in B, like in the fifth and in the main root note. So, and maybe something, this is off key for sure. So maybe something like this. I don't know. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna uh, root these leads to some tracks. And I'm gonna delete the limiter of the master. Okay. So let's, let's search for some drums. Uh, this is like a totally fresh uh, pack that will be coming out this month. So I'm go just gonna use, I don't know. Please pick some kick for me. <laughs> I don't know, this can work. It's from Secret, so it's probably good. Yeah, I'll, this isn't like a really hard kick, because yeah, no, I don't know. Let's just make this pattern and delete here the kicks. And let's add some sidechain for the bass for sure. Okay, maybe more aggressive. Yeah, and the same for these, but maybe less aggressive. And for this one too. Let me see if they got any effects. Of course they have some reverb. Yeah, so I'm gonna play it and watch the volumes. I think the ARP could be a bit uh, lower in volume. I just, I'm just thinking. And maybe I'm just gonna get rid of the reverb here and the delay. I'm gonna slap an ODT on here. I think this could be maybe louder. And I'm just gonna EQ it because it for sure does have some frequencies that we don't need. Yeah. me add a reverb yeah, I'm not really sure if it's gonna work um, yeah, this bass got quite a lot of ice so I'm gonna probably just uh, high cut them but like this or maybe I will just add a filter and automate it this could work too. Maybe make it more open to the end of this and go back down. Yeah, I'm not 100% convinced. 
distance maybe open it really really much here uh, okay and then just copy completely the same thing we did here gonna make it unique and yeah, I need to change the step of course and yeah this is what we got so I'm probably uh, gonna add some claps oh, I don't really know how they sound uh, this is pretty difficult <laughs> Or maybe I will just leave the claps until like here. Just gonna add them here. Or is it too soon? Maybe yeah, I'm just gonna copy them over here and also I don't know. Maybe the kick is too loud and also the claps, so I will check. seems a bit too loud, maybe even the claps too. You know what, I'm gonna, just gonna go to the vision, the vision pack and I'm gonna use a few samples from them. So probably some drums like... Let's add this clap enhancer. Okay, this is taking a bit too much time. No. Yeah, that's how we roll. Okay, let's add maybe right here. Okay, and we need some hi hats. This is gonna be okay, I think. I hope this isn't that bad. Um, I think we can automate some stuff over here. Maybe the, the delay, or we can create like a short delay. Uh, yes, ping pong on. Okay, let's try to automate this. Wait, uh, is it, which serum is it? Okay, it's this one. I'm just gonna do probably something like this and <laughs> who knows? Maybe it's good, maybe it's not. Maybe I can automate also like the... Do we have a filter? No, we don't have a filter. Mm, maybe we can automate this. It's the shape. Okay, yeah, that's... That's gonna be helpful. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, let's like open it like every five bars every four bars and open it right here and I'm just gonna copy it okay uh, 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 what can we add maybe a crash on the beginning of the drop <laughs> okay and let's let's add the piano piano is always pretty decent so I'm just gonna yeah I need to make different chords but whatever I'm gonna load through pianos okay oh I didn't want to do it like this I don't know let's add this note <laughs> Or maybe here. Yeah, this piano is gonna be pretty loud, so I'm gonna just turn it down 
add some side chain, really subtle. And I'm gonna add a lot of reverb probably. It should be like more in the background. I'm gonna add it over here. Right, so we need something that will make it better. <laughs> Let's add this narrow. I don't know if. Okay, it's 128. And I'm gonna turn down the volume a bit. I don't know if this will fit. Okay, okay. So, okay, here is the top loop. Let's add it, whatever. What can we add? Maybe some kind of harmony to this uh, bass line. Uh, I don't want to overdo the drop. Or maybe some strings, that could be nice. I hope contact will load really fast, but... <laughs> yeah, let's see. Let's add like a violin. This should be good, and okay, B and D, A and C. And let's go from up. Yeah, I'm gonna play it for you, and I'm gonna search for a sustain string. So we are in E, I'm gonna probably add, okay, maybe this one, and fit it to tempo, easy, what can we do, 10 minutes left, so let's do, let's add some effects, uh, some sweeps, and sweeps up, okay, maybe like before the snare roll, or no, okay, let's do it like this. <sighs> yeah, so maybe I'm thinking this hasn't got release, right? Okay, I'm gonna add a bit of release. Maybe try and make a build up, or I can add more sweeps to the second part of the drop. Yeah, I'm getting getting a bit lost. <laughs> I, I'm not sure how it's gonna sound. I'm really curious. So I'm gonna add like short build up probably with this sound. Okay. Mm, and the piano? Why not? So let's take the piano to another pattern and... Wait, how did the progression go? No. C, B and A. I'm gonna make some bass notes. And I'm gonna probably spread the piano a bit. Just to get m a more natural feel. And maybe add some strum and add this sustain string add the sweep and some snares we need some some 909 snares you can find it over here probably snares hip hop snares yeah probably mm, <laughs> which one maybe this one <laughs> okay i don't know if i chose the right one but whatever, I'm gonna make like a quick snare roll. This is gonna be probably a bit too loud. So I think we got like 10 minutes left. And yeah, I'm gonna just uh, automate this snare a bit. Yep. And just do the automation over here. Mm. 
maybe add we can maybe try this as a fill I don't know how it's gonna sound and maybe reverse the kick over here okay I hope this isn't too loud or I don't know maybe this can be louder and what else what else what else yeah let's add the string over here too and we need to get rid of the kickstart if I'm not mistaken yes yes also also the kickstart from the piano I'm just gonna link it to the automation and this kickstart as well just gonna link it too Yeah, uh, I don't know what else to do. I don't want to overdo it. <laughs> Maybe we can automate like uh, the shape of the sound. So I'm gonna like make it from short to long. And then back to short. Okay, and I'm gonna filter it out probably and increase the reverb over time. And uh, the okay, maybe even the delay could be pretty cool. And filter, I'm just gonna fully filter it out uh, on the beginning. And okay, I'm gonna add this crash. The sweeps are maybe too loud, I, I don't know, maybe even the crash is too loud. And yeah, I think what we can do else, maybe some kind of riser, something that's in E. This is probably nice. But I don't know what to, uh, what else to do to make it more interesting, maybe mute the hi-hats over here when yep and the clap as well also we can what can we do we can add sweep down over here too and this one is pretty loud probably i'm gonna add this tremolo ambience which is so fucking awesome but needs to be lower in volume and okay it's in key and need to stretch it should be really low in volume you need to get ready for this pack <laughs> okay so i think i'm done i don't know what to uh, what else to do so uh yeah let's listen to the final result <laughs> this I didn't actually expect this this is kind of not that bad except for the ride the ride is horrible like oh why why did that did I add this <laughs> this is so horrible yeah I didn't even adjust the volume of it <laughs> It's, I mean, it's kind of cool. Like, I like it. Maybe the chord progression, let me listen to it. Uh, 
Yeah, I'm not sure with Discord. I'm I don't like it that much, but like the rest, I mean, it's kind of kind of okay. <laughs> I don't know what you think, but yeah, uh, for 30 minutes without even listening to this, I'm kind of proud. <laughs> Alright guys, that was it. That was pretty fun actually. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this. Maybe you learned something new and yeah, see you in the next video. Ciao, ciao.